So hello everyone, I'm in G Technology. We are looking at some G Drive with Mac. I've just got a MacBook Pro 13 inch touch bar and then there's a USB-C and then I heard that it's, uh, it's brilliant, it's fast, but like what can I get for it? Because sure. for now, for now I have two um, those slim G Drive, slim like SSD. This? Yes, exactly it is. Awesome. Brilliant. But then I need something more, like desktop and yeah. something like that. So there's a couple cool things. But the first thing I want to show you is the USB-C cables and the differences and what's going on. Oh. So USB-C is really the shape of the connector, but there's yeah. also Thunderbolt 3, which has the same connectors. The cables look a lot the same, but there's a big difference in what's, in what's going on. So it's very important to understand what flavor of USB-C you've got on your computer, what your device can do, and even what your cable will do. And so these markings you can find on the cables. But if you have a USB-C Gen 2 host device and you use the wrong cable, you won't get exactly the right performance. What we're showing here today is the G-Drive Thunderbolt Ooh. 3. We've also got a G-Raid with Thunderbolt 3. So these are beautiful, all aluminum drives, five-year warranty, enterprise class 7200 RPM drives. These are awesome. So single disc, this will go up to 250 megabytes a second. So as you can see, we've got these daisy chain, and the G-Drive has one Thunderbolt 3 cable coming out of the back, and you can see we've actually got this plugged into the USB-C port, not the Thunderbolt port. The two oh, this, Thunderbolt ports are... These two are Thunderbolt ports. That's right. So and you'll see that the labeling shows the little Thunderbolt lightning icon, uh, while the USB port has a different icon for it. So this one is just um, USB 3.0. Yep, that's right. Speed? So this is uh, going to give you USB 3 performance. Okay. okay and because okay. this drive maxes out at 250, there's no sense in putting a faster port on this because it, it doesn't deliver more speed out of that port. Now the G-RAID below actually does break the threshold of the USB-C Gen 1, and we needed to put a USB-C Gen 2 to get that extra performance. So this does feature that USB-C Gen 2. You'll also notice we added a HDMI port. That is great. That when is we're great. connecting, um, we're able to actually get video through that HDMI. So I can have this on my desk, uh, have it always connect to my LCD screen. And then when I get home, plug my MacBook Pro to this, one USB-C cable That's right. give me uh, data from this hard drive give me display, That's right. does it charge my MacBook Pro as well? So, uh, a little bit. We actually have on the bit. Thunderbolt 3 drives, we're delivering 15 watts of power delivery, and that's mm -hmm. another feature of USB-C and Thunderbolt 3. Yeah. We also have another product we'll look at in just a minute that delivers 45 watts, and that's just the USB-C G drive. Okay, so now we're gonna take a look at some USB-C products, not Thunderbolt 3, but USB, okay? The first thing I want to do is show you my favorite portable USB-C drive. I have one. This Great. is the G-Drive Slim SSD, and this is a beautiful, fast 540 megabytes a second in a one terabyte and slim profile. So this is, uh, it's got the USB-C port, so we can take advantage of that. Uh, it's a great little fast drive, super lightweight, very reliable. So the next product I want to tell you about is awesome. This is our G-Drive USB-C. The back of this has no Thunderbolt ports, but it does okay. have one USB-C port. And what I really like about this one is it delivers 45 watts. So in some cases, I have to bring my notebook charger, charge up my notebook, plug in my drive. Some products are going to be uh, you know, using the notebook power to spin the drive. Yeah, in this yeah. case, my G drive is powering my notebook. So I can leave that adapter at home, simply plug this in, and charge up my notebook while I'm doing it. It's a That's great, great way to make sure you don't use up those few ports that you do have. Yeah, yeah, That's, that is so great. One cable gives you power and access to the hard drive. That's right. <laughs> One of the great things at G-Tech is now we're a big part of a family of a bunch of other brands. SanDisk, WD, G-Tech, we're all one big family now. And so we get really great flash that we put in our SSD. Uh, when you buy an SSD from G-Tech, it's the same SSD every single time you buy it. Yeah, yeah, when you buy it from other people, sometimes it's a different one inside, mm. the performance might change on you, and when you have to have reliable performance, very consistent. So this is one of the great benefits of, of G-Tech as well. And they all look so good. Performance style <laughs> and reliability. Yeah, yeah. I like, I, like, I like them a lot. So that's it. Okay. Thank, Thank you, you so very much. much. Thank you very much.